Hello guys, welcome back to the Terror Tips and in this video I am going to talk about how to fix WWE 2K22 your controller or gamepad is not working and how you can fix this app. So let's talk about the solutions and if you are for the first time to our channel then don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. So let's dive into the solution. So the first one and the first step when you are having this trouble is you just have to restart your PC. That, that is what you have to do. And to do restart you just have to go over here and click on this icon and go for restart. Once you are done with the restart you have to see and you have to try to play the game and you have to see whether you are able to fix the issue or not. So next step even after trying this if it's not working then we have to talk about the next solution. Next solution is all about you have to exit the game turn off your controller okay you just have to turn off your controller now you just have to turn on your controller back then connect it to the computer then you just have to go to the steam and you have to try relaunch the game and you have to see and in most cases this has to be fixed okay now even after trying the second step even the still you are facing with the issue we have to talk about the next one next one is all about you have to unplug mouse or keyboard whatever it is and you have to check i mean you have to try to launch the game and you have to see whether you're able to fix the issue up in some cases and i'm not suggesting this is going to work but in some cases it might work but the fourth step here it is this is going to help you guys out and i have seen it in the reddit as well as steam community as well as in the wwe official twitter accounts and in the forums for the many users this help with them so the next one is all about you have to do is i also unplug all usb devices you just have to unplug all usb devices and you just have to uh, launch the game then most probably this has to be fixed and this is what you have to do now even after try this you have to see whether you are able to fix the issue up or not if it's not working then we just have to talk about the fifth solution fifth solution is all about you have to launch the game while launching the game you have to press alt and enter all together on your keyboard that is what you have to do and this will be helping guys out a maximum extent and even after trying this if it's not working then we just have to talk about the next one next one is all about you have to launch the steam i mean you have to launch the game in big picture mode and launch the game right so in order to launch the game in big picture mode you have to follow the instruction you just have to click over here and you just have to go over here at the top steam then you just have to go over here in the settings now from here you just have to go over here on the settings sorry uh, i just got confused in order to launch the game in big picture mode you just have to go over here there is an option called big picture mode so you just have to click on this one okay now as you can see this is in the big picture mode right now what you have to do is you will be able to find the game okay you will be able to find the game and you just have to do the necessary and you can play the game over here and if you want to do uh, exit from the big picture mode you have to click over here and go for exit big picture mode sometimes these methods will be guys you helping you guys out and even after trying with this if it's not working then we have the solution number one i mean next solution so next solution is all about you have to change the screen refresh rate on your windows 11. so to do this you just have to follow the instruction go over here search for settings okay go over here on system then you just have to go to uh, display from here you just have to go over here in the advanced display now from here you just have to go over here and as you can see choose a refresh rate this being set to 300 so you just have to extend this and set this to 60 okay once it been set, set into 60 just minimize this one go to steam and try to play the game and that most probably has to be fix you guys out and even after trying this if it's not working the next is all about you have to turn on steam overlay that is what you have to do which is the eighth step so for that you just have to go over here on the steam you just have to go to the library from here you have to select the wwe 2k22 now from here right click and go to properties you can do it this for i'm just showing you an example go over here over here and as you can see now as you can see in the general i have been set this up so you can set this to you can turn on steam overlay from here you just have to do this 
Once it is done, you just have to play the game and most probably the issue has to be fixed. And don't get confused when I'm showing with the crap game because uh, I'm not having WWE 2K22 because I'm having an issue, I'm having issue with my credit card. So I could not purchase it. So uh, that's why I have been purchased it. So you can just follow the instruction. Now the next step is all about ninth step. Even after trying this, it's not working. Then we have next one. So that is all about you have to configure the controller. So to configure the controller, you just have to follow the instruction. Just open your Steam. Okay. Now you just open your Steam. Go to store. Now from here, you just have to click over here at the top. Navigate to settings. From here, there is an option called controller. Go over here. There is an option called general control settings. Okay. Now from here, as you can see, you have to select which one. If you are playing with Xbox, set this up. If you are playing with PlayStation, you have to set this up. If you are playing with any other thing, you have to do the necessary. That is what you have to do. So this is what you have to do over here. And you have to check whether you are able to fix the issue up or not. Even after trying this, it's not working that we have solution number nine. Solution, uh, sorry, solution number 10. Solution number 10 is all about you have to select high performance in graphics setting or you have to use or play the game in dedicated GPU. So to do this, you just have to follow the instruction. Just go over here, search for graphics settings. Over here, as you can see, I have added two games, Crab Game and Forza Horizon 5. I have already added this. You have to click on browse option. Go to local disk where the game is installed. You have to add the file .exe file or application file from here on the WWE 2K22. Once you add it, you will be getting the WWE 2K22 here. Now what you have to do is you just have to click on this one. There will be an option called options. Same for Forza Horizon for both. So you just have to click on this one and you have to set this to high performance. Same for you have to do for WWE 2K22. And once it is done, you just have to minimize this one and go to Steam and you have to play the game and you have to see whether you are able to fix the issue up or not. Even after trying this, if it's not working, then we just have to move to 11th solution. 11th solution is all about you have to uncheck the controller in Steam controller settings. So to do this, you just have to go over here, go over here on the Steam, go to settings, click on controller. And what you have to do is you just have to go over here in general control. And now you have to set according to your uh, which of the controller you are having, you have to do accordingly. When most probably after trying setting up the controllers, you can set this up accordingly. And once it is done, you have to play with this one. And you have to see whether you are able to fix the issue up or not. And even after trying this, if it's not working, then we have one more solution which is called disable, enable, or disable or enable Steam input. So to do this, you just have to go to the library. So as I said earlier, I'm have not having the game with the credit card issue, so you don't have to worry. So what I do is I'll be showing you, you an example with the crap game. So uh, select the game WWE 2K22 on your PC. Then you just have to click on properties. From here, you just have to go over here on controller. And there is an option called disable steam input. So you have to click on this one. First, you have to enable steam input and you have to see whether you are able to fix issue up or not or you have to go through the same follow the same instruction and disable the steam input and try to play the game and most probably the issue has to be fixed so these are the basic steps which you have to try out when you are having the issue and also make sure parallelly as step 14 you have to make sure that your windows is up to date or you will be having the trouble so this is also very important you just have to go over here and you have to make sure that you are on the latest version of windows and most probably Sometimes if it's you are having any kind of update, you have to do the update and you have to see. In the same way, you have to close this up. And also, you just have to make sure your graphics cards are up to date. So you just have to go over here and you just have to go to Task Manager. Sorry, you just have to close this. You just have to click over here and navigate to Device Manager. From here, what you have to do is you just have to go to Display Adapters. And make sure if you're having two cards, that means you're having two dual uh, graphics card, you have to set this to NVIDIA Geo, uh, GeForce RTX because that's how it's going to work. Or and you just have to enable the respective one. And also make sure they're up to date by searching over here, but it's a very quiet method, uh, which is very normal one and most of you guys are knowing about it. So you just have to do accordingly. And this is what you have to do. So these are the best thing which you have to try out when you're having an issue with WWE 2K22 controller or gamepad is not working and how you can fix this up and this is what you have to do and i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification see you soon in the next video peace out